And if you miss it earlier, Storm Team 8 has published the official winter weather outlook for the upcoming season. Yes, we have. It's at woodtv.com right now. And we're forecasting basically a wetter than average season with increased snowfall and a quick start to December. But now, in a new decade, the numbers that we use for comparisons will change. So meteorologist Emily Skydema is here now to show us how climate averages are measured and where we stand now. When it comes to normal in a West Michigan winter, it's kind of hard to define, but we do technically have a definition of normal, and that comes from the National Centers for Environmental Information. We get new 30-year climate normals every decade, so we take a chunk of 30 years, and every decade we update that to give us a new definition of normal. So we got those new normals this year. Over the past decade, we've been talking about normal in the sense of the data from 1981 to 2010. And now we're using data that's taken from 1991 to 2020. This method helps us to maintain a climate baseline and helps us give you the best information with the current data that's been collected. So here's how things have changed across the United States over the past decade. Notice things have gotten a lot warmer for most of the country. The exception here is the northern Great Plains where things have trended a little bit cooler and not everyone has gotten warmer by a lot, but the general trend has been for things to warm up across the United States. When it comes to precipitation, a little bit of a difference. A lot of areas have received a little bit more precipitation, so the new normals include more of that precip, but notice in the desert southwest especially, things have trended drier. Now in West Michigan, this is how things have changed. Temperatures over the winter, so this is taking meteorological winter months, December, January, and February, the old average was around 33.1 degrees, the new is 33.6. That means we've warmed up by about half a degree. In terms of precip, we've actually gotten a little bit wetter too. The old winter precipitation was around 6.38 inches, now it's 7.12, so we've gotten about three quarters of an inch wetter. Snowfall also has increased in Grand Rapids. Our new average snowfall, average annual snowfall, is about 77.6 inches here, so we've gained about two and a half inches of snow. Something interesting to note that's not true all across West Michigan. For example, Muskegon actually has a new normal that's less snow than it was over the past decade. Lansing, the same situation happens there. So in West Michigan, we've warmed up a little bit over the winter. We've been seeing more precipitation over the past decade. We'll have to see if that trend continues in the winter ahead.